How's it going guys? We're going to go ahead and review Panda Free Antivirus 2016. Now, I'm going to go through this antivirus program and I'm going to tell you guys why I like it. But first, before we go through that, I'm going to show you where you can download it. And like I said, it is for free. Just go to google.com and type in Panda Antivirus Free and click here where it says Free and Lightweight Antivirus Panda Security. Click there and then click the free download button here. It will ask you if you want to upgrade to the full version, but if you want to use the free one or try out the free one first, click on no thank you, and your download will begin. Once you download it, this is what it looks like here. It's actually very easy to use. If you notice right away off the bat, it's got a scan your PC button here. When you click on there, you can go ahead and select if you want to do a full scan, which will take, uh, like it says right here, several hours to complete. If you kind of know where the virus is at, you can click on critical areas. Well, actually, no, this is so it can do a quick scan in the critical areas. You can actually do this one first and then the full scan. So that works pretty well. You can also do a custom scan if you want to, if you know where the virus is at and when you want to do, you know, custom, customize it where, point it where you want it to scan. And all you do is just, I'm going to do a full uh, critical scan real quick just to show you guys how that works. And then click on start scan. And there it goes. We're going to minimize that for now. Now, what's really cool is uh, you can also protect your USB drive right here. You go to USB protection. You can actually vaccinate is what they call it, a USB drive. I'm going to go ahead and plug one in real quick. All right. Should be detecting it here in a bit. And when you plug in a USB drive, it's going to ask you if you want to scan it right off the bat. I'm going to say not now for now. And there it is. Let's go ahead and vaccinate it. Let's try this out. This is actually the first time I'm trying this, guys. So let's see how it goes. Should be vaccinating it. Let's see how long it takes. Now when it vaccinates it, cool, there's a check mark on it. When it vaccinates it, it should protect it from, uh, you know, any viruses. All right, guys, drive already vaccinated, it says right there, so that's cool. It should protect any viruses from getting into the thumb drive. Let's go back real quick. Now, if you click on this little downward arrow right here where I'm pointing at, you can also um, go to the settings. And under settings, if you go to antivirus, here you can go ahead and turn on the rest of the protection because not all of it is turned on if you notice here. Permanent protection is on. The scan compressed files is off. We could turn that on. And ask before neutralizing viruses. Right now it's off. If you wanted to ask, you can turn that on. So here you can go ahead and um, and change all the settings there. What's really unique about this Panda Free Antivirus is process monitor. This function right here now to to actually look at it right now it's on we're in the settings right now so let's go back if you down go down here to process monitor you can actually see what processes are running which processes are accessing the internet which are high and threat and which have been blocked by the antivirus program this is very very cool back in the day you had to go down here in the bar right click go to task manager if you're on windows 7 of course windows 8 is a little different and here you got to look at all your processes and but what's cool about this program is it puts it all for you right there when you're trying to look for a virus which is really really cool now let's go to the second page right here in the second page right here you can actually get support but I believe the support is not available when you're using the free antivirus all you can do is go to the forum and get uh, help if you actually pay for it if you go upgrade to pro they have a technical support so you can't use the technical support unless you upgrade to pro and when you upgrade to pro I'm gonna click on it real quick just so that we can see so here it is this is how much it costs thirty five dollars if you want to upgrade to pro all right now let's go back Let's go to antivirus. All right, 
so we clicked on the downward arrow here and here you can select antivirus process monitor usb protection let's go to antivirus on here you can actually do scheduled scans i wanted to show you guys how you can schedule a scan clicking on here click on add scheduled scan and here you just name it whatever you want we're going to name it test frequency you could do it daily weekly i recommend weekly on sunday night like at 12. That's where I recommend you uh, do it. Or maybe even it's at 7 p.m. Whatever time works for you. A lot of people like to do it weekly on Sundays. All right. And here you can choose what type of scan, entire PC, critical areas. I recommend entire PC. All right, guys. Click OK. And now it's and now it's scheduled. So every Sunday at that time, it will scan automatically for you. All right. And like I said, it's very easy to use, guys. Very easy to use. And it has many other features here like share ideas and solutions, settings, customization, about Panda free antivirus. Notice we're using the version 16.1.2. So you can tell they've been around for a while. They're already version 16. Every year they uh, open, they make a new one. So that's about it, guys. Go ahead and comment on the comment section of the video. If you have any questions, go ahead and subscribe. We're, we are going to be uploading a heck of a lot more antivirus reviews. So stay on the lookout for those. And I'll see you soon in one of my other videos.